Hey guys, we got something special going on today. Some of you wanted to uh, know what I thought about this game, so why not actually play it, record it, and tell you that way? So this is, I can never say it right, and I bet you I'm a butcher it, a Vorion? A Varion? I don't know. But uh, I'm here with Red Rabbit. Say hello. Hello. He's been playing this game for a little while now, so he knows a lot more than I do, so I wanted him here to... Uh, Help me go through this and do a nice little review with you guys. So, the first thing we're going to do since we're in drone... What are these, drones? Yeah, like mini mining drones. But we're going to go after some iron to get started with it. It seems like it's pretty well put together so far. I, I, you know, I've been tinkering with it with fear for about the half hour now. I don't want to go that <laughs> fast. I'm going to mine this thing right here. I'm going to eat it up. But this is the, uh, the mining... You just go up to the blocks, you eat them up, just like anything else, even uh, the other games that we play, you just mine them. You start mm -hmm. off with the uh, mining lasers, nothing else. So you want to run around and start just getting as much iron and stuff as you can and start crafting your first ship, which we'll actually do here. I'm going to show you that as well. Yep. For me, of course, most of you guys that know me from watching my channel know this game is a little too blocky for my tastes. But it has definitely got good features in other aspects, that's for sure. Like, the build mechanics of it's not too bad. Where's the next one? Where'd you go? You uh, left I'm me! I'm flying away. Like, there. picking up all this loose iron. <laughs> iron oh, there's one. Where? Uh, up here. There? There? Where? Here? There? Uh -oh. uh, other hey! Way. Shoot at me! I'll shoot at you. No, no, it's it's. I'm pointing to it. The mining lasers. Which <laughs> way? Can't this do. way. This way. Not me. In the way. And then it's got little boosters. If you hit the space bar, there's definitely yeah. collision in this game. I yeah. found that out the hard way. <laughs> I had a little trial run, yeah. Eating it up. Now I want to get at least oh. twelve, twelve hundred or more. Here's another asteroid right here. And then we can start hmm? showing you guys the oh. build mechanics. It doesn't have the roll like, like uh, mm -hmm. most fighters and stuff like that. You can't roll left and right, apparently. If there, if there is a way, I haven't figured it out yet. I'm going to take a look at the controls just to make sure here in a second. Let's see. Because um, Q and E doesn't ASD work. Is basic. Yes, it does. You go up and down. Ah, so that's just up and down, but it doesn't pitch you left and right. No, Z and X uh, to rotate. Oh, okay, so there it is. Whee! It does work. Okay, <laughs> there's another asteroid right there. I'm going to go up to that one. Alright. <clears throat> I do like the sounds in this game, actually. It does have some decent sound effects in, uh, for the engines and things. I actually do like that. I don't know what the music's like. I have it turned off because I do not record with the uh, in-game music due to it could be copyrighted, and I don't want to deal with those messy issues. Yeah, no, of course. But what else we got to play with, Rabbit, in this game besides just the mining aspects and the building? You were in, uh, the well, different stations, how do they work? Go ahead and explain that so we can get an idea on how we're going to be doing that when we play with the stations. Yeah, sure. Uh, um, the crew see, stuff. There's, yeah, there's, um, well, there's the stations first. There's a couple of different types. You have the, the ones with what look, well, they always have a symbol, right, on the top left of the little green box. Uh, they'll usually be green because when you start in a game, it will always ally you with one faction. And of course, that faction is allied to some factions and its enemies to others, so you might get attacked, funnily enough. Um, which happens every so often, to be honest. There will be pirates coming to the sector. I mean, it tends to happen, so you want to build your ship relatively quick. Um, but yeah, as far as symbols go, <laughs> I almost crashed into this one. <laughs> Taking all the mine, all the iron. <laughs> Distractions pays off. <laughs> Man, <laughs> I've only got one thousand. Same two. here. <laughs> hey, you got more than me. So what are you complaining about? Oh, do I? Uh, all right. Um. So yeah, as you can see, there's like different white symbols. The anchor is a shipyard. That's right, where right. you can uh, you can actually build your ship. Uh, there's also a repair dock. And you can sell goods to almost any different, um, any different building, if you will. Uh, you also have the resource depot, which has the symbol in the top left, which looks a bit like um, 
I don't know. Timber, ingots. Ingots. Well, it looks or almost ingots, like the yeah. ingots, yeah. I don't see how you'd get wood in this place, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you also have the microchip really far away. Now, those ones are special because they will sell and buy turrets and also right there. sell and buy upgrades. They are very, very special. You can actually, if you uh, click with the middle mouse button or the scroll wheel, whatever you want to call it, press F to interact. You can talk to them from this distance, but you can't actually trade with them until you're docked with them. Sweet. So you can see what they're selling and stuff, but yeah. Alright, should we get building? Yeah, yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna do it right here. Right, so just gotta go up into the top right corner where the flag is to find the ship. Would you do that by um, lifting the left shift button and then you come up here to go click? And we're gonna yep. call it. Why not? We'll just do it. 500 iron for found in my sh nipples. <laughs> Alright, right mouse button. Wait, why is there an arrow? An arrow? I have an arrow on my I mean, screen. Oh, yeah, that arrow just shows the direction of your ship. So, whichever way you're facing. Ah, okay. Well, we're going to start press with. Press B, right? Yeah, we're going to start with the yeah. iron block. If it lets me. No? Wait. There's the block. Why? Whoa, scroll out. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I was like, where's my shake? You can do that. There it is. Okay. So, <laughs> we got different options you can see here. When you do WASD, it gives you different ones you can choose from, and you can sh just move your mouse to make it go bigger. So, if you hold the W, you expand the block completely. A, you uh, it goes in the direction that you see the color, the, I don't even want to call that blue, purple maybe? So, that makes it longer. S is, will do it wider. D, Longer, longer. Okay, so let's do something here. Um, and W will actually just make it the whole thing bigger. It's first of all, sorry. let's shrink this down. Bring it out a little bit. Let's go like there, and then extend it to like that. Let's make sure we're still facing the right way. Okay. Now I want the mirror mode on for myself. We'll do the x-axis. No. Guess it'd be the Z. No. Let's use the Y axis. Thank you. <laughs> now, I like my stuff as centered as I can get it. Actually, we need to shrink it a little bit. There we go. Let's put that on there like that. Yay! Whoa! <laughs> you like them That's apples? a lot of blocks. That's not a lot of blocks. It's just a little bit of blocks. It's pretty. It's a little tiny little block. Alright, yeah, let's get the nice. uh, all around Sleep. thrusters. Let's shrink this thing down. It, it, uh, one it, thing you might need to explain go. to the viewers as well is that this isn't like other games where you have to have the engines pointing in different directions. You have two different blocks. One is your main engines that always point backwards, this right and here. the other one's the thrusters. Which is right the, here. Those are the thrusters, yeah. The ones with the lots of diddy little holes in. They kind of just, I don't know if you can see my ship, but they kind of stabilize it. They reduce your uh, drag and everything, pretty much. <laughs> Gonna move a little now here, bit. You know, I do have a question. Do I have to put the uh, the regular engines on the front or just the back? The regular engines, uh, wherever you want, really. I mean, they will always be pointing backwards, so it's not really that big of a problem. Okay, so these In are only your forward thrust engines, then, is what I'm saying. Yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So uh, the let's ones see. In the big globe. But... I know I need crew blocks too. So which one? How do I know which one's a crew block? Okay, here we go. Crew quarters. We're going to need yep. some crew quarters down there. Let's make sure we put that on there. Let's see. Where do we want the crew at? Hmm. Got an idea. Uh, go up, me and You can idea. also see how many, uh, how many actual crew members can join as well. Uh, on the left, you can see all the different stats, and the crew quarters is one of them. It'll just say, like, plus whatever. And that way you know what you're adding before you actually put it on your ship. Let's see, where is seven crew? Okay. Let's just put that right there then. Ha ha! Huzzah! Yeah. Alright, is there any other blocks we need to worry about? No frameworks. Let's see, we have crew, cargo. Do we need cargo? Uh, cargo, I mean, yeah, but it's not a necessity at this early stage. I mean, that's more when the pirates come in and they start dropping all these things because there will be massive, massive battles in space. 
and you can just either help them out or go around collecting all the different things. But the pirates will attack you if they're still alive. Gotcha. All right. Also, it helps with the alliance, and if you're attacking the pirates in that sector, then the people of that sector, the faction that own that sector, will become allied to you even more. And right there, just because I can, I want to. There we go. Looking good. Now let's get those turrets on there. Let's see, we've yeah. got the uh, mining turrets. We want those up here in the front. Then we've got our guns, which we'll put those here and here. Oh, wait, it only supports the one, that's right. So we need to get our selection tool over here. Oop, go back into build, please. Oh, I have a chain gun turret to start with. Interesting. Lucky you. Alright, <laughs> delete that. What do I start with? The chain gun. Oh, you too. Let's just put that right there. Alright, we're good to go. My ship's acting weird. It's sideways. Great. I think I built it sideways. <laughs> I built my ship sideways! <laughs> did <you>? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Wait. How? I don't know how, but I did it. <laughs> My ship is sideways, it's, it's slender. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool, it's got like a Millennium Falcon feel to it. <laughs> Alright. Right. Um, so, yeah, you see all these little red symbols that are under the top bars of the screen? Uh, they are essentially what your ship is missing. And if you hold shift, you can hover over them and see exactly what they mean. We need crew, which we can go do that now. Not enough crew to man the guns or the drills, and not enough mechanics. So we are going to go to the shipyard, right? The one in front yep. of us, the ingots? That, that big one with the ingots, yep. That's usually the easiest one to get to, and it will have your starting ones. It may not have certain, uh, certain crew types, but it will always have the basic ones. Ooh. Sorry, I thought you almost crashed. <laughs> Maybe. Right, Collision let's... is not a good thing in this game, trust me. <laughs> Sack C. Mm. Okay, so we want to hire some crew. Uh, we need... Actually, let's see. Hit P. Go up to... Oh, by the way, what you side saw me do here is I just hotkeyed these to 1 and 2. So I got my my gun to 1 and 2. My turrets are hotkeyed to 2. You just click it and then click the corresponding number. Which isn't bad. So we need two gunners, four drillers, and one mechanic. Let's see if I can do it right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Higher crew. Okay. So we need one, two. Oh, I bought three. Dang it. How do you sell crew? <laughs> you, you can't sell crew, but you will always need crew in the future, so it's not a problem, really. As long as you have enough space for them. <laughs> and the other thing we needed... Let's go just get four crew members. Actually, I think I can only get three. Alright, let's see what we got here. All positions filled. Nope, we need two more for the driller. Wait, I got six in my engineer slot. Why? I got four um, crew, so it's, I got six in there. How do I... How do I uh, uh, uh. Is it because it's also assigning them? Yeah. Maybe? Yeah. So let's dis 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 the screw. He'll be gone, and nobody. Oh, so I can't reassign it. Uh, only the normal crew, yes. But the the um, how can I put this? The ones which are just crewmen that aren't designed to. Well, they don't know a specific role. Then they can be reassigned. But the ones who do know a specific role, they get dismissed. And if you dismiss them, that's it. They're, oh, they're gone. Okay. You gotta buy more. Let's get some crew members here. Let's just buy six more for the heck of it. There we go. Yeah, you might and need some more crew quarters. Assign. Maybe. I need more sergeants to assign more there. Okay, so that's not gonna work. Can I put that there? No, I need more sergeants. Err! So, go ahead. Auto assign. Whatever. I'm in trouble. <laughs> it's okay, dude. Alright, um. Mining. And I'll fix yeah, my you, ship later. We can't actually get sergeants from this place. The That's the only thing, right? You have to get the different rankings from different places. I mean, you can't assign a normal worker, a normal crewman, gotcha. to um, 
to be like a sergeant. They have to be that type. Oh dear. Uh oh. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <There you> <laughs> But so far, it seems like a very interesting game. It's got a lot. Uh, it seems to have a lot to it. Ooh. Yeah. Despite. I think I got a big mining. Sorry. What? What? I got a heavy mining. Hey, 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 hey! Oh my god, dude, dude, calm down. Calm down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you just blew up a bit of my shit, man. Oh, hang on, hang on. Let me let me repair real quick. Okay, you repair. You have to wait 25 seconds to repair your ship. You were recently damaged. <laughs> yeah. oh, damn it, man. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> but like I said, it seems like it's got a decent ow <laughs> gameplay mechanic to it. It looks like it's going to be interesting, especially if they actually up the graphics. That would actually make me happy. Then I'd uh, definitely play this game. If they worked on the shapes, yeah, I think the right. graphics are okay, but the shapes are a bit too blocky. But there's that. pirates, there's missions, there's a whole bunch to this game. You know, it's pretty. There's another asteroid. Uh, over there. So what else? What else is in, in, in this game besides just running around mining? Uh, well, yeah, like I said, with the alliances, you will have to uh, see different pirates and stuff. Well, you'll have to kill pirates. Uh, every now and then, at the right of your screen, uh, you will see something like your ship is detecting, I don't know, energy fluctuations or something like that. And after a short period of time, they will get stronger, and after an even shorter period of time, you will see that either aliens have made it the sector, or pirates have made it the sector, or something of the sort, you know what I mean? So there's definitely conflicts and diplomacy and all that stuff works, and sounds like it's interesting enough. I might actually tinker with it some more on my own. I don't think I'll be doing a series on it, though, because I just don't have the time at this moment. I'm so deep into Imperion and running the server and getting everything copacetic and going right. We're having a lot of fun with that, and I really damaged my ship bad. <laughs> oh, yep. dude, there you go. Pirates are Pirates. attacking the sector. I yep. see you. Let's go get myself killed. <laughs> uh, right, they are actually very secluded right now. I don't think it would be a good idea to charge head first, but yeah, sure, let's, let's, let's do it. Why not? I mean... <laughs> Usually what I tend to do is wait until the military forces join, and they will fight the pirates, and then we could just be in the back like pew pew pew. But, what's, but here's my thing, what's the fun in that in a review? Uh, to be fair, here they- <laughs> oh wait no, that's someone teleporting away. <laughs> They're like, get me out of here! <laughs> At the start, uh, it's not exactly considered a good thing to fight three pirates head on, but... Yeah, if you middle mouse button, you can actually see that total health and things. But it's my total health! It doesn't work! Roll! Man, roll this thing, will you? I can't move anymore. <laughs> <laughs> You're getting shot up by old sides, man. Now, you can actually explode different sections of the ship, which I like, to be fair. So you can take away their thrusters. You can take away their guns if you a good enough shot at it. I don't think my gun works any- there it goes. No! Don't! Turn! Go! I will survive! <laughs> I do like the explosions on this game though, it's very, very intriguing. Oh! Uh oh. I don't like it when the explosions are on me. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm running away a little bit. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> How dare you abandon me to my will of death! I am so stuck. I have it's no thrusters. I can't. I can't turn. Don't I can't turn. I'm drifting away. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm doing is drifting away. I have a. I, I, yeah, I have nothing. I don't even know how I'm. I'm like turning here. It's okay, right? If you press B, um, on the left of your screen, you will see like a little. I don't know what that is. A symbol, basically, uh -huh. and it just says repair ship. And for me, I need three hundred and fifty iron, so I am. Absolutely useless right now. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed the review. As you can see, it gets pretty interesting. Pretty interesting. Yeah. Gets much better at later levels. As you can see on the top left, there's lots of different types of elements that there are to be discovered. And in the future, you will be able... Well, in the future... It, it, <laughs> I blew as, something up! 
<laughs> you blew something up. Oh yeah, I'm blowing oh, things nice. up. <laughs> I'm seeing it from here, dude. Oh, look, the Corvettes have entered as well. There's two Corvettes fighting alongside us. Just try and get away from it. Try and get away. Oh! <laughs> yeah, okay. okay. I'm gonna get away, alright. <laughs> I can't even, I've only got one engine left. I think you dropped your gun. Yeah, uh, you dropped yeah, your gun. That's my drill. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. I'm trying to drift towards you, but it seems <laughs> impossible right now. I'm drifting. Come on, turn. There is a very, very slight amount of turning. It, luckily, this isn't the end. You know, if you do have, if you do find this, oh, I just hit a rock. Okay, I'm spinning. Sorry. Um, as this war wages on, the enemy pirate ships they will drop uh, metal in their hulls, and you can actually collect that to repair your ship. Uh, and aside from that, I mean, they will also be dropping loot, so that's uh, something else. <laughs> that's intriguing. I might actually build a ship and see what happens and play with this for a little while. Ah-ha! Their gun's gone! Take it! Take it! Take it like a man! <laughs> I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just floating around in space shooting. <laughs> 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 I'm down to like a block. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. I hope you enjoyed the review on this. It, it seems like it's interesting. Um, especially, a, a, it's, for me, it would be a really good diversion. You know, to come in here by myself, just play around and build little things like that. But there's... Building-wise, it's it, it has nothing on the, the games like Imperium and stuff. So I wouldn't get the same satisfaction I do from there. But it seems like in-game content-wise, it has a lot to give. And... I think it could be enjoyable with all the mining, the pirates, and all that stuff running around. But they're, they are AI. It's the, what are you going to do? But anyways, like I said, hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to play hard and game hard. And until next time, take it easy. Thanks for watching. Bye.